Welcome back to my channel. I am here again. I want to teach you about multiplying polynomials using algebra tiles. So here, the prerequisite is that you already know how to multiply integers. And that you also know how to multiply involving variables. So if we multiply two positive integers, the product is positive. For example, 7 times 6 equals 42. If we multiply two negative integers, the product is positive. For example, negative 7 times negative 6 is 42. So this rule involves like signs and factors and the product is always positive. Another, if we multiply negative integer and a positive integer, the product is negative. Example, negative 7 times 6 equals negative 42. Another, if we multiply positive integer and negative integer, the product is negative. Example, 7 times negative 6 is negative 42. So these involve like signs of factors. And the product of this rule is always negative. Let us familiarize the tiles below. Blue square tile stands for positive 1. Negative square tile stands for negative 1. Blue rectangle tile stands for positive x. White, uh, white rectangle tile stands for negative x. Big blue square tile stands for x squared and big white square tile stands for negative x squared. So, we will be using this in our operation. Represent 4x using tiles. 4x, that means there will be 4 positive x tiles. We have, that's it. Represent 3x squared using tiles. There will be 3x squared tiles. 1, 2, 3. So that's 3x squared. Now let's do the operation. For example, we have 4x times 2x. To get the product using the tiles, let us first draw perpendicular segments. At the top of the horizontal line, or segment we have 4x and there will be four positive x tiles we write or we put here that's it and to the left side we put 2x and we have two positive x tiles so to multiply these tiles, we multiply tile by tile. So we have x times positive x. The answer is x squared. Another x times positive x. The answer is x squared. x times positive x. The answer is x squared. x times positive x. The answer is x squared. We now have the product in the first row and let's proceed to the second row we now multiply x times x equals x squared x times x x squared x times x x squared x times x x squared so we are done in multiplying the tiles inside is our product so we have to count the tiles that are the same 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 so we have 8 x squared tiles our product now is 8 x squared 
Now let's have an example with the positive and negative factors. 4x times negative 2x. By using the tiles, we have to write above 4x and put the tiles, positive x tiles, 4 of them. And to the left side, we have negative x tiles. There are two. So we multiply this. Times x negative x is negative x squared. We have the white square tile. x times negative x is negative x squared. x times negative x is negative x squared. x times negative x is negative x squared. We are done with the first row, so let's proceed for the second row. So x times negative x is equal to negative x squared. x times negative x is negative x squared. x times negative x is negative x squared. x times negative x is negative x squared. So our product is placed inside, so let's count the negative x squared tiles and there are 8 so our product is negative 8 x squared another example we have two binomials we will get the product of this 3x negative 2 times x positive 1 to get the product using the tiles we have we have three positive x tiles. For negative two, we have negative one. Two, we have two negative one tiles. And x positive one, write it at the left side. We have one positive x tile and one positive one tile x times positive x is x squared x times positive x is x squared and x times positive x is x squared then we have 1 times x is negative x another 1 times x is negative x so we are done with the first row Let's proceed for the second row. So x times positive 1 is x. x times positive 1 is x. x times positive 1 is x. So we have 3 x tiles. And let's proceed with negative 1. Negative 1 times one positive is negative 1. Negative 1 times positive 1 is negative 1. So we are done in multiplying both sides. So our product is here in the middle. So notice we have negative x and positive x. This will be 0. Another negative x and positive x. 0 again. So remove this zero. What the product is 3x squared positive x negative 2. So try to multiply the following using tiles and compare your answer with my answer. That's all folks, thank you very much.